Today on All About Sports Cards, we take a deep dive into this mail day with a package from Phil Hughes. Welcome back to the channel. Today we've got a mail day opening, this time with a box from Phil Hughes. Yes, that Phil Hughes. The self-proclaimed baseball tosser, wannabe chef, and most recently, a guy who opens cards on YouTube. What is up everyone? My name is Phil. The channel is Phil's Polls. He has a huge following on Twitter. I've left a link in the description below with both his Twitter account and his YouTube page. I've also left a link to Phil's eBay store, Phil's Polls, because as much as he collects, he also sells cards. His store has a great selection of baseball, basketball, hockey, and even Pokemon cards. All of that leads us to this box. I bought this from Phil not more than three days ago, and it's already here. It arrived lightning fast. But before I open the box, let me put into context what we'll be looking at. I tweeted this card out yesterday. It's a 2018 Topps Luminary Auto of Al Kaline, who just passed away at the age of 85. It was easy for me to locate this card because it's part of my micro collection of members of the Baseball Hall of Fame who've signed certified on-card autographs. So while there are sticker autos of Hall of Famers, like this one of Whitey Ford, or cut auto like the one of Rogers Hornsby from our last episode of This Week in Breaks, which, by the way, you should check out after watching this, or through the mail autos like this Bobby Dorr, which I sent to Mr. Dorr unsigned, and he sent back to me with his autograph, those kind of auto cards, even though they were all Hall of Famers, would not make it into my collection. I prefer certified on-card autographs like this 2004 Topps Finest Moments of Willie Mays. Nice, right? Or this Sandy Koufax 2014 Topps Finest Rookie Card Reprint Auto. Ooh, that's a good one. Here's a few more from my collection. How about this great looking Chipper Jones from 2016 Bowman Draft? Then there's this Mike Schmidt from 2014 Topps Finest. Another card from 2014 is this Ernie Banks Topps Tribute. And how about this 1997 Tony Gwynn Bowman's Best? Here's Derek Jeter from 2017 Topps Transcendent. Now, if you're unfamiliar with Topps Transcendent, it's a high-end release that sells for $30,000 a case. What? The Rogers Hornsby cut auto you saw was pulled from a case of Transcendent. We've covered that release extensively with our one of one pull tracker on our website. I've left a link to that tracker in the description too. In covering that release, it became one of my favorites for adding Hall of Fame autographs like this Pedro Martinez, this Mariano Rivera, which is also from the same year as you can see, and this Cal Ripken Jr. Now I love the layout. It's just a beauty of a card. I love the gold framing. It's a nice touch. And then there's this one, this Hank Aaron. It's from the same year as the others, but looks different because it's an exclusive card from the VIP party that Topps held in Atlanta with Hank Aaron as a special guest. It was only given to collectors who attended the party. And with that, we've come full circle to this box from Phil Hughes and the card I just purchased from him. So let's open the box and take a look at what's inside. I'm really excited to see this card. This card looked spectacular in photos, so I can't even wait to see what's up in person. That's a lot of peanuts. I wonder what Phil was thinking about when he was packing this. Showing you how to make the ultimate peanut butter and pickle sandwich. Wow, look at that. Nice packing job, Phil. And on top of that, he's thrown in two packs of something. But how am I going to get the packs without revealing the card? Okay. Let me just... 12 seconds later. Okay. So, oh, nice. Threw in two packs of Bowman. He's been opening a lot of mega boxes lately, so... Thank you, Phil, for the packs. Let's take a look and see what we've got in the packs. Josh James, 
Paul Goldschmidt, Yon Mankata, Christian Yelich, who is our hometown hero here, Will Myers, Justin Dunn, Alex Kirilov, Logan Webb, Ryan Helsley, and Lion Richardson. All right, let's move on to pack two. Let's see if we can hit something nice. First card out will be Stanton. And we're looking at Martinez, Altuve, Urias, Arcia, Allen, Madrigal, Tavares, Cameron, and Gore. Okay, now I can use this to cover the major card that I purchased. Thank you, Phil, for that bonus. And let's do a slow roll on this one. This is a great card. Ready? It's transcendent. There you see Seattle. And there you see the kid. It's Ken Griffey Jr.'s gorgeous card from the VIP party. Wow. It is better in person. Holy moly. Look at this thing. This is gorgeous. Yep, there you see it. You see this autograph, Ken Griffey Jr., produced exclusively for the Topps Transcendent VIP Party. So there you go. Look at this thing. 25 of 25. eBay 1 of 1. But it's not going on eBay. This one is permanently in my collection. And look at this gorgeous, gorgeous signature. Honestly, this is, this is about as clean as I've ever seen Griffey signature. Just a gorgeous card. So there you go. Awesome mail day from Phil Hughes. Thanks for watching.